Hello, I'm Roger Bisbee from Skill Builder, and I'm out today looking at a little bit of a damp problem. This is 200 year old brickwork, and it's starting to decay. As you can see, there's certain signs that it needs a bit of pointing, needs a bit of tender loving care. Now, one thing is that they're getting penetrating damp through to the inside in places, but the other thing is that these aren't cavity walls, these are solid walls, so the insulation isn't great. Now, they do say that wet insulation is no insulation at all, and laboratory tests have proved that if you have dry bricks, you get better insulation from dry bricks than you do from wet ones. So what I'm gonna do with all this brickwork before I start replacing some of the spalled bricks, this is frost damage, is to coat this whole wall in a storm dry masonry cream. Now I've used this before. The first time I ever used it is when I had a customer whose RCD, the electrics kept tripping every time they got heavy rain. And I worked out that what was happening is that the water was penetrating the wall and it was getting into the back of the socket and it was just causing a short and tripping it. Now I gave that wall one coat of storm dry many years ago, I'd say 12 years ago now, I painted that one coat of storm dry on and it cured the problem absolutely, completely, once and for all, and they've never had a tripping problem with that electric since. So I know it works and it penetrates the brickwork, dries out, and then once it's dried out, you don't see it. Now this is a grade two listed building. So there's certain things you can't do in it. We couldn't render the wall, for example, and we couldn't use one of those awful plastic coatings. So an invisible treatment that cures the problem is exactly what's required. So you can see by the line here that it is slightly darker, the brick. Actually, I think that's quite nice because it's kind of enriched the color slightly, but you just have to be prepared for that. The best thing obviously is not to stop halfway along a wall, but to carry on. But having said this, it's only 24 hours after we put this on. So it will continue to be absorbed by the brick and you will see that line fade. So after a couple of days, this will be a lot less pronounced. So if you had to do a patch, you would find that after a short time, it was barely visible. And of course, the good thing is that unlike some treatments, there's absolutely no sheen on this. It's completely matte and a completely natural looking finish. Now I would just say the way that this works is that it doesn't fill up the cavities, the little pores inside the bricks, the capillary pores, if you like. What it does is it lines them with a kind of glass-like substance, and that stops the moisture soaking into the brick. But what it also does, very importantly, is it allows that moisture to escape. So we're not locking moisture in here, we're actually allowing the wall to breathe, which is what everybody talks about all the time. Any locked in moisture can evaporate and it just stops new rain from soaking in. So a great product. I've used it on several jobs and will continue to use it because it is a real problem solver. I'm Roger Bisbee from Skill Builder. Come back soon because we'll be doing more on them.